Hippos, short for hippopotamuses, are massive animals primarily found in sub-Saharan Africa. They are among the largest land mammals and are known for their large size, barrel-shaped bodies, and massive mouths. There are two main species of hippos that people often refer to, the common hippopotamus and the pygmy hippopotamus. The common hippopotamus, or hippopotamus amphibious, is the more well-known species. These hippos can weigh as much as 4,000 to 8,000 pounds. They have a large, sloping back and short legs, giving them a distinctive appearance. Common hippos are primarily found in rivers and lakes, where they spend most of their time submerged in water to keep cool under the hot African sun. This behavior is crucial as their skin, although thick, is sensitive to sunlight. Their natural habitat includes rivers, lakes, and wetlands, making them excellent swimmers. Common hippos are social animals and typically live in groups called pods or bloats. These groups usually consist of around 10 to 30 individuals but can be bigger in some cases. The pods are made up of females, their young, and a dominant male. The males often engage in displays of strength to establish dominance and maintain their status within the group. Hippos are herbivores, feeding primarily on grass, and they often graze at night when it's cooler. On the other hand, the pygmy hippopotamus, or Chiropsis liberiensis, is much smaller and less known. These hippos are found primarily in the forests and swamps of West Africa, particularly in Liberia, Guinea, and neighboring countries. Adult pygmy hippos typically weigh between 400 to 600 pounds and stand about 3 feet tall at the shoulder. Their body shape is also different from the common hippo, being more compact and agile in the underbrush. Unlike their larger relatives, pygmy hippos are not as social. They tend to be more solitary or live in small family groups. They are more nocturnal and might spend more time on land compared to common hippos. Their diet consists largely of fruit, leaves, and grasses, which they forage in their forest homes. Pygmy hippos are also semi-aquatic, like common hippos, but they don't require the same water bodies for their daily habits. Both species have unique adaptations and behaviors shaped by their environments. For example, common hippos are known to spend a lot of time in water, which helps keep their body temperature regulated. They also have a special way of closing their nostrils as they submerge, allowing them to stay underwater for several minutes at a time. Pygmy hippos, meanwhile, have adapted to life in the dense forests and are more elusive, making them harder to spot. Despite their impressive size and fascinating characteristics, both types of hippos face threats. Common hippos are vulnerable due to habitat loss and poaching for their meat and ivory-like teeth. Pygmy hippos are classified as endangered, with their numbers declining due to habitat destruction, hunting, and human-wildlife conflict. Conservation efforts are underway to protect these magnificent creatures and their habitats. Protecting natural environments is crucial not just for hippos but also for the broader ecosystem that relies on healthy, diverse habitats. In summary, the world of hippos offers two distinct types, the common hippo, known for its size and social behavior, and the pygmy hippo, smaller and more secretive. Both species are remarkable in their ways, showcasing the diversity of life and the delicate balance of ecosystems. Understanding and conserving these creatures is essential, as they play important roles in their environments and share our planet with us.